Today, I'm gonna teach you something super simple, super easy, and that is how to change the volume of the click track and the tone of the click track. I think a lot of you guys would like to know how to do this, so I'm gonna show you how right now. All right, so here we are in a brand new empty GarageBand window. This should look familiar. Upper left-hand corner, click on GarageBand. Go down to Preferences, Preferences, Opened. All right, here it is. Are you ready? First one is General. Second one is Audio slash MIDI. Third one is Metronome. It's not a little guy who lives in the city. It's the thing that goes click, click, click. All right, so, <laughs> um, so here it is. Tone and volume of the click track. Pretty simple. I'm just gonna push play. That's it, it basically gets more clicky down here. Or actually has a tone up here. The nice thing about using the one with the tone is it will most likely be the one that cuts through a mix uh, unless you're playing in that exact key, whatever that is. Sounds like C. It is C. So unless you're in the key of C, you can use that high tone and uh, and you should be, you know, uh, fine. Uh, I think that's about it. Super quick, super easy video, but I know that there was a bunch of you out there who didn't know how to change the volume or the tone of the click track. So here you go. Now you know. Peace, love. Have a great weekend. Bye-bye.